friends! So today I want to talk about YouTube channels that are making content that I really enjoy right now. People who are active this year, right now, that you can go subscribe to. These are not in any particular order, by the way. You just need to check them all out. They're all my favorites. The first YouTuber I want to talk about is another YouTuber from Kentucky. There aren't very many of us that I know of. Her username is Betty's Kitchen and she obviously makes cooking videos. She's from a small town in Eastern Kentucky where there's a state university. She used to work there. Her and her husband are retired from that university and now they make cooking videos. He films, she does the cooking, and it always looks really awesome. She talks a lot about Kentucky. She goes to different restaurants around where she lives and uses some local ingredients and makes a lot of dishes that are typical of this part of the country. These next two are kind of together even though they're two different people and two different channels but they do a lot of videos together, collaborations and stuff, but it's Gunnarola and Songs to Wear Pants too. His username, now I think it's just his name, his name's Andrew. I'll put all the links will be down below. The videos are different, they're very creative and often kind of outside of the norm, but that's what makes them so great, that's what makes them so enjoyable to watch. Next is a channel I know I've talked about before, Miss X Rojas, I always get her name wrong again, all links will be down below, but Rosiana, she's a British YouTuber, she's fantastic. She's recently out of college, just got, I think she just got like a big kid job, which I'm super jealous about, but she's very, very intelligent, very well spoken. She's very eloquent, can speak very well on lots of topics, but she also loves like pop music and teen lit and different things, so she's not like, you know, super up there. She's really down to earth and really awesome, and she's funny, she's smart. Her videos are quite often just her, you know, talking to a camera like this, but she's so much better at it than I am. This next YouTuber you've probably heard of, people talk about him a lot, he has a lot of videos that are really popular, but it's Zay Frank. He was like an original vlogger back in the day of YouTube, like 2006 or so, and I didn't watch him then, but so many people were so excited about him coming back, I started to watch him, and I have not been disappointed. His videos are also very thoughtful, he talks about different topics and kind of makes me feel better about life. And so I really enjoy watching his videos, but also he does these videos about different animals and like things that they do. And it's supposed to be like informative, but they're also really funny. It's supposed to be like a nature documentary type thing, but it's always really funny. And his videos are always really enjoyable. Next YouTube channel you might've heard me mention before again, um, it's a channel called The Biggest Beauty Project. And it's where five girls, talk about their lives, talk about body positivity, which is what the channel was originally about, but it's about so much more than that now. Um, there's a different topic every week. This week it's talking about something that you've done this year that has surprised you, either good or bad. So anyone can relate. You don't have to be a big person to enjoy that channel, and yes, I'm on it. And I don't want to just use this to promote myself, but I know my friends on the channel work very hard, and I know they would really appreciate it if you checked out our channel. Next is What Travis Says whom I adore. Travis, I have a big internet crush on you, so I hope that's okay. He makes videos about Doctor Who, makes a lot of videos about comic books, and now he works at a comic book store like my TV crush, Stuart from the comic book store on The Big Bang Theory. Maybe I just need to go hang out at comic book stores. His videos are very funny and informative if you want to learn about things like comic books and Doctor Who. Last year I had this Kickstarter to send a TARDIS weather balloon up into the atmosphere, like send a TARDIS into space. And that's awesome. They haven't been able to do it yet because they had problems finding helium. There's a big helium shortage. And now they did. They're waiting until like the weather's nicer because you can't really do that when it's super cold. So hopefully he'll be able to do that soon. Hopefully we'll be able to watch that because I know he's going to record it all. And in March, he's been doing March, Travis says, and he's been doing a video every day this month. He's just funny and smart and I adore him. So you should go check him out. The next channel I want to talk about is The Brain Scoop, which is not for the faint of heart, not for those with weak stomachs. But that channel came about because... Hank Green and SciShow went to this museum at the local university there in Montana where they live. And it's this museum where they preserve animal specimens, so there's a lot of like dead animals and taxidermy things around. And they talked to this girl Emily there and she, you know, talked on SciShow and everyone just loved her. She was fabulous and she's kind of like quirky and fun and really, really smart. And so she got her own show, The Brain Scoop. And she works with Michael Aranda, who I just realized is not on this list. You should also check him out. Sometimes she, like, cuts up dead things, and it's a little bit, you know, not for the squeamish. But she just has this great personality, and a lot of the videos don't have gross stuff in them. So check those out. And if you want to see, you know, her skin a dead wolf, which does happen and is a little bit, you know, don't watch while you're eating lunch. But Emily is just this great, intelligent 
person who makes these really awesome videos and Michael's video quality is always amazing so they're really well done between his video editing and her awesomeness you just can't miss that channel. This is Mike Falzone who I also adore. He follows me on Tumblr which makes him one of my favorite people and he does music on YouTube, he does comedy on YouTube, he does awesomeness on YouTube. He's been on this channel Waywire recently where he does tweet tap, talks about Twitter stuff with his girlfriend Coffee Girl who's also very funny and awesome and all of his videos are just really great. He does these vlogs where he just like walks around his neighborhood with the camera pointing himself and he just like talks about life and you're just like oh my god that's so true. Last but certainly not least is the Merry Pedestrian, Abigail Doris, I think her name is. He makes videos that are like art, like, you know, I just make videos where I talk to the camera. Hers are really, really amazing. She like takes footage of different things out you know, in her house or in the world and she plays music over it and has different words and it's just these like beautiful inspirational videos, these like really awesome works of art and she's beautiful and awesome and they're just really different but really, really amazing. And also she's always so sweet. She's like the nicest person. She's like pretty, makes these great videos, and she's really nice. In her videos she seems really sweet and then like whenever you leave a comment she'll respond. And like most recently I commented on how great her video was because it was. And she was like, oh you always leave such sweet comments. And I was like, you're a flawless human. So lots of different kinds of YouTubers to check out in my list. They will all be linked down below. Please check out all those channels that sound interesting to you, go subscribe to them. If you like their channels, tell them I sent you. Please leave me comments about your favorite YouTubers who are making awesome content right now. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope everyone is doing really well and I will see you all later. Bye.